What's up guys and welcome, you are watching Fazzy Fitness. So the Portugal Pro 2023 Men's Open Bodybuilding is in the history books. And as predicted and as expected, the defining champion Andrea Presti looked absolutely amazing here. And he won this show for the third consecutive time. He was shredded and right on the money. But the fans will be delighted to hear that the man who pushed him hard this time is none other than Roman Fertz who also looked at his all-time best. And this time, he finally got the attention of the judges. And I'm gonna say at one point, especially in the final callout, it looked really, really close between these two guys. So let's break it down. Roman definitely had better set of wheels compared to Andrea Presti. And consequently, he had better balance between his upper and lower half. But Presti had that insane width, as you guys can see the difference between the front large spread and the back large spread between these two guys. But I think what really sealed the deal for Andrea Presti was when they turned around and hit the back double bicep. It was Presti all day long. So congratulations to him for securing his Olympia spot. And a big congratulations to Roman Fritz for his career's best placing. Now what about Vilad? What happened? Very simple, the judges are giving a clear indication that sheer size with no symmetry will not be rewarded anymore. And the thing is, there were a lot of people who were saying that Velad is gonna give Presti a run for his money here. But the thing is, he looks really impressive on Instagram, especially in certain shots. But here he got really exposed because he lacked that symmetry big time. And because of that, he didn't even make top 5. Emir was placed third. A very respectable placing for him tonight. He also competed in Ampro Classic Spain and he was really improved here. His conditioning was a lot better. And it was another disappointing result for Peter Klonser. And the reason I'm saying that is because a guy with that kind of frame, he should be battling it out for the top sports. But he's placing fifth in this kind of lineup. He desperately needs to bring up his back. So we are gonna have to wait and see what they decide next. Whether they are gonna go back to the drawing board or will they continue their pursuit for the Olympia qualification. Christian Wolski placed fourth here. I will talk about this guy a little more as more pictures and the videos come out. Because as of right now, I couldn't find any individual posing routines. So we will talk about him more tomorrow. Now what about Lionel Bayeki? Is this the end of Lionel? To put it bluntly, I'm gonna say yes it is. And the thing is, the fans weren't expecting any miracle from him either here. And that is exactly what happened. Plus, you have got to consider the age factor as well. He is in his 40s now. And we just can't expect from him to bring his best at the tail end of his career. But props to him for committing to this show. And actually showing up better than last year. Not just better, a lot better than last year. If this guy could just nail his conditioning, I mean, just look at his frame even now. It is really sad. So now I am gonna cover some classic physique results. And I will talk about Stefan separately, but for now, just know that Antoine Lot, he causes a big upset and beats Stefan for the title and gets his Olympia ticket. So what are your thoughts on the results? Do let me know in the comments below. And hit the thumbs up button if you liked the video. And smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thanks for watching.